Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. In this video, I'm starting second unit. So first of all, I want to make this clear to everyone. Uh, as everyone is asking notes in the comment session, uh, like we are preparing from the textbook. So we had, I mean, I am just writing the keywords. I mean the short notes. So I cannot provide you any specific notes. If you want, you can take the screenshots from the video itself. And you know, th from the second unit, uh, second unit is a lengthy one. It nearly consists of more than 200 pages in the textbook itself. So it's uh, it has taken a lot of time for us to prepare the videos. So the first topic in second unit is human interaction with computers. That means we need to understand like how people are interacting with computers. That means but to understand it, people should know the characteristics of the computer system and what are the things, the conditions that, that are causing the problems. That means past and present things which, are, which have already caused or causing the problems for the interaction process. So in this uh, inter, uh, human interaction with computer, we have three subtopics again. So the first one is like why people are having trouble with computers. That means in the interaction process, why they are facing uh, trouble. So the first one, uh, first reason may be like use of jargon. J what is this jargon? Is like technical words. That means use of more technical terms. So when we use more technical terms, people may not uh, understand them. And other reason is like non-obvious design, poorly designed interfaces. That means when the interface is not clear, attractive, people get problem, right? I mean, they feel somewhat trouble in using it. And other one is like they have extensive uh, te uh, technical knowledge, but no or very little behavioral training with the usage of uh, graphical capabilities that means they are not given specific training on the usage of this graphical capabilities of the interface because uh, because of this reason they may feel trouble so here i have listed very few uh, you can learn more and also one more thing uh, you need to i have just uh, um, uh, given the titles under this you need to write a description for everything that means here i have uh, use of jargon so under this you need to write usage of more technical terms that means uh, technical terms are not understood by everyone this may create trouble so for every uh, title you need to give description okay then coming to the second subtopic we have responses to poor design that means because of the poor design what are the responses from people there are like typical responses given by them like they said they are confused they are annoyed they, they are frustrated and many other things so what are the reasons for this frustration and, and confusion? So people said that there is some difficulty in understanding the conceptual model of the uh, interface. That means because of the poor design, they are unable to understand the model, like how it is working, how, like how we need to use it uh, and all the fe features in it. And other thing is like because if they are unable to understand the frameworks, it's like very difficult for them, right? So these two reasons are related to confusion. And other thing is like annoyance. Why annoyance? Because uh, because of slow computer reaction times. That means when you're searching for something on Google or some in any website, so if it's like buffering, so you feel like annoyed. At very uh, I mean slow reaction times. And if it is providing outdated information, screen distractions. Screen distractions is like. Uh, when you are watching, I mean, when you are reading something on a um, online platform, if like uh, continuously, if you are getting some pop-up messages or advertisements, because of that, you you may be distracted. That means your screen automatically it shows that uh, advertisement in a big uh, dialog box. So because of that, you are distracted. Another one is like inconsistencies in the design. These reasons are related to annoyance. And when this annoyance becomes more and more, you get frustrated. That means you cannot complete your task in time. You will, I mean, you need to complete all your tasks in deadline. But because of frustration and all these things, you may not do it because of inflexible features and unforgiving systems. That means unexpected or unpredictable re results given by the system. And with all this, they said they are also panicked, they are also stressed, they are also bored them because of this poor design. And the third topic here is people and their tasks. That means how people are behaving and how they are working. So in that, so whenever we consider an employee, he may have several situations, several conditions uh, regarding his families or in office uh, conditions. So because of that things, uh, sometimes he may be very disturbed, distracted and all. He may not be okay to work. So because of that, he may not work properly and he may not complete all his works in time. So because of that, the work gets overloaded. He get fatigued, he might be interrupted. So the reasons and this end results, I mean, because of these family or office conditions, what are the effects he will get? I mean, like him, as he is not having much interest, he will ignore the documentation here. 
and he may not uh, correctly identify the problems he may not understand the problems and he will also not think about uh, how to solve those problems and he will have very little information why little information because he is not having interest he is not concentrated that much he will ignore the documentation so when he ignored the documentation he missed a lot of the contents there itself and other thing is like overestimations this overestimations is like uh, our superiors think, think that we are in a position of like doing all the technical works but because of these conditions we may not do properly but they estimate that i mean they think that we can do anything that means overestimation of our super uh, superiors okay